Hi, today we're going to talk about croup. Croup is a disease that affects a lot of young children and it's very common. What is croup? So when people say croup, they usually talk about a high-pitched cough, a seal's bark or dog barking cough, I hear a lot too. Um, and also noisy breathing, which the correct term is strider, when you're breathing in. And what happens is that the airways in the larynx and in the trachea and in the bronchi are inflamed. Croup sometimes can have a sudden onset. Your child can have like uh, symptoms of a viral illness for a couple days, for a few days, for even one day, and then develop the symptoms of croup. If your child doesn't seem in distress, so no trouble talking or have bluish discoloration around lips or fingers, and seems to be able to breathe, what you can do is keep them calm, give them some cold fluids to drink, and also turn on the hot water in your bathroom. Don't put the child in the hot water, but sit him in the room with a closed door for 10 or 15 minutes for that humidified air to be breathed in. That can also be followed up by cold air exposure. Yes, cold air exposure has been studied and it has been shown to help with those symptoms of croup. Make sure they're warm and they're bundled up and take them outside. 30 minutes of cold air exposure helps with the croup symptoms. In summary, if your child has a barky cough and noisy breathing when breathing in and they are not in the stress, you can try some of these remedies at home. If they do not uh, look like they're doing well and they're having trouble breathing, call 911 immediately or call your pediatrician.